notifications, you can then choose to turn off the constant spam. The final thing I recommend turning off is the annoying action combo guide that appears by default. To do this, press escape, go to edit UI and untick the action combo guide box by clicking the eye icon. There's a bunch of other UI functions that you can also play around with here too. Something that might confuse new players and be hard to get used to is the combat and gearing in Black Desert. When it comes to the combat, you should not hotkey all of your abilities to your hotbar, as many of them will do reduced damage and be less effective than if you used the combo controls for that ability. A combo control, for example, being Shift Right Click, F and W, S and E, and many more. You can see the combo controls for different abilities by pressing K, bringing up the skill window and hovering your mouse over your abilities. There are however some abilities that can only be used if you hotkey them. Generally you want every ability that can't be activated with a combo control on your hotbar. Gearing in Black Desert is kind of weird and hard to explain but it's certainly a lot different to what you're used to in other MMOs. Instead of constantly getting new pieces of gear from quests, dungeons and raids, you will instead get gear at around level 20 that you probably won't change until level 50. Instead you'll just upgrade it with things called blackstones. So let's say for example at level 20 you've got an Egerian chest piece. You'd then probably upgrade that gear to plus 5 until you hit level 50, when you'd then switch it out for a Grenil chest which you'd then enchant to plus 17 or 18, then only swap it out for the best in slot boss armor which you'd upgrade as much as possible. Black 